Bruce here from Panasonic, and this is how to do a thing. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up additional profiles in the Panasonic Fire TV operating system, including kids' profiles with parental control restrictions. So, let's get started. First, go to your home menu and then scroll across until you get to settings and then go down until you get to profiles. You can also get straight to here by just saying to Alexa, go to profiles. You can have up to six profiles on your Panasonic TV, including four kids profiles. Let's add a new profile. So select uh, create a new profile, enter name. Let's call this profile child one. Press play. You can add or change a profile icon. So I'm going to go down and choose one that looks very childish. Not that one. <laughs> that one. So go into that profile. Right, once you've set up that profile and you're accessed into that profile, go to account and profile settings. Type in your PIN number. And then here, we can go to parental controls. So now that we've turned parental controls on, we can pin protect you know, purchases so they can't buy anything accidentally. We can also set uh, ratings for both Prime TV or Prime Video options, as well as broadcast ratings. So if I wanted to go into Prime Ratings, I don't want anything that's rated above family. So General and Family, so let's just assume this is for a young child, you can re restrict and block whichever ones you want. We can also do the same thing for broadcast ratings. So I don't want those. Anything above that, when I select M, will be locked out. That just picks it up from the EPG. You can also pin protect inputs like the HDMI inputs. So for example, on HDMI 1 in here, we've got a gaming console plugged in. If I don't want them playing games without me saying so, then I can pin lock that particular input as well. It could also be a cable TV box or some additional inputs. So whatever you like, you can pin protect those as well. And then of course you can change your pin number here. When you're typing in the pin number, it works using these circular keys or directional keys on your uh, remote control. So at the moment, I've just got that pin there, but you can change that pin to whatever you want. And there you have it. That's how to set up additional profiles and set up parental controls on kids' profiles. If you found this video useful, give us a like and subscribe. No, I'm joking. <laughs> if you're looking for more information, check us out at panasonic.com or check out some of our other videos on YouTube. Thanks for watching. See you next time.